Oh my, it's just changed form! Oh my, that's even worse! Anyways, this is Kenjin1913, and we're let's playing Dragon Quest 7. We're fighting the... We're in the sem second episode of the semi-finale of Dragon Quest 7. And we're fighting the Demon Lord, Oakmire, to avenge God for his death. Anyways, what we have to do here now... I think he's got like 4,000 hit points. Oh, and he's much tougher now. At least physically, jeez. Anyways, what we want to do is... Now we use Ultra Hit and take away a nice chunk of his ability, uh, his HP. So yeah, you want to have one designated healer. And he has like over 4,000 HP. I think his first form had like 2,000 HP. Or something like that. But yeah, that's a, that's uh, that's at least 1,200 damage right there. Uh oh. Oh, it's not too bad. Uh oh, no! Two breath attacks! Ow, ow, ow! That's alright. Ogmire can't stand up to the power of Ultra Hit! Take that! Oh yeah, 590. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're kicking his butt now. He's on the run. This guy isn't so tough. I wonder why God had so much trouble. Well, I mean, God kind of softened him up for us. And now we're just taking him out ourselves. So yeah, just continually cast Helios. Or use the Sage Rock or whatever. Yeah, there we go. Ultra hit. Look at this ability. Yeah. Take that, Ogmire. We beat him. We beat Ogmire. We've avenged God. Yes. Take that. How did these puppets defeat you? Because we cut our strings. <laughs> yes, yes. Scream your last screams. Your soul, eh? You don't have a soul. You're pure evil. Bye bye! Look at that, we defeated Ogmire. Yes, there are people waiting. Yes, we did. We finally avenged God. Yeah, there you go, Gabo. Yeah, there's no way we could lose. Not with Ultra Hit on our side. So let's get the frig out of here. Oh, we can't use outside? Oh yeah, we are. We are back in time or something. So let's, uh, I guess we'll have to... I don't think we have to walk all the way out of here. I want to say there's a portal. Yes. Look at that, even though... Ooh. That's God. Is that God? I don't know. But... That's it. Look at this, and now the island... <clears throat> they're, they're, uh, actually, this is called this Island of the Terror Spirit, but I'm just going to call it the, the God Island, I guess. It's coming back into the present. It was there in the past, remember? Anyways, I just changed discs, because that was the end of disc one, and now we're on to disc two! That's right. This game isn't over yet. We need to revive God. Yes, we are finally rid of the Demon Lord, thank goodness. Yes, the Demon Lord is gone. And we brought peace to the world, yes. But there's one island, yada yada yada. Yeah, we, we, we totally brought back all the world and then defeated the Demon Lord. Can we, like, take a break or something? Yeah, so all the people in the world must be pretty happy that we won. And maybe that's why there's there's peace in the world now because because the demon we defeated the demon lord in the past. Yeah, Mary Bell will never never believe we did all this. Look at Melvin, he was able to avenge God's death and 
help fight by his side, sort of. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, thank you. Yes. Our prayers and blah blah blah. Now we have to revive God. So, yes, okay. Let us go revive God. And basically we use that, that thingy. We use that uh, warp gate. We can go down and to the earth. To the lower lands. And here we are. Back in the ruins. Oh, come on. Yeah, we could we could eat, man. We just beat the demon lord. Yes, we're gonna go revive God. And to do that, we need to find the legendary Tula player. And help Ira on her mission. So let's go. Yeah, poor Gabo, he's hungry. He's always hungry, though, damn it. Yep, now we have to... We have to, uh... Get the Tula player and do the same thing we did uh, a long time ago with Kiefer and Maribel and everybody. Do the old dance in the Tula thingy. Back in the old Deja or whatever. Yeah, so let's go to Fishbell before we figure out... Well, well, we have to go talk to King Burns and stuff. Otherwise, we can't advance the uh, story. But first, let's go... Uh, let's go talk to Maribel and everyone. Tell them we revive, we uh, beat the demon lord. We're awesome. We're super aw- whoops. We're super awesome. Mega super awesome, baby. Yeah, and you thought after we beat the demon lord, the game would probably be over, huh? Not even close. Well, we're a little closer. Yeah. Oh, poor Mary Bell. Poor Mary Bell. I know what an she's she she's pretty nice. Yeah, she looks like a wilted flower. You're right, Gabba. Yeah, too bad we can't get a five person party. I don't think they've ever done that in a Dragon Quest game. Anyways, I wanna come back here to the Hamla place where you got the uh shard from the the man and Basically, I forgot to get a tiny metal, and it's right in front of that gravestone. So, now we're here back in... <clears throat> excuse me, now we're back in... Istard, and now we're talking with Pandora. He slayed a huge monster. Nice job. Oh, I don't think you did. This guy is really... He's gonna be the Dream Warrior. What is that Dragon Quest VI reference there? Really, the dream warrior? You probably have a better chance of being a dragon warrior than an actual dream warrior. Man, that Hondora, there's something wrong with him, man. Always looking to make a quick buck. Yeah, you, you're, you're probably complaining because... Well, I'm not exactly sure. So let's, uh... Let's go in here and talk to King Burns. He's actually... Wait a minute. Did I see him down there? Yeah, he's actually eating Dindin, or... Or he just finished eating Dindin. And now we're going to interrupt him during dessert. That's right, maybe we can get some. Wonder if he's got any ice cream. Princess Lisa. So let's talk to King Burns. Well, before I do that, let's talk to you. Listen, Lisa, you gotta get over it. Your brother is never coming back. I don't want to be mean anymore, but or sound mean, but that's that's just the way it is. So yeah, they just finished eating, and so let's see what King Burns wants. Yes, yes, we've totally done a ton of stuff. Our travels are not at an end quite yet. Yeah, we have to uh, restore God. Just repeat the, uh, Demon Lord. So yeah, he's just telling us, hey, Madra is a place where, where, uh, where there's all kinds of music, even though we kind of already knew that. Thank you, man. 
Yes, okay. Keeper would have wanted it, blah, blah, blah. Alright, I know it's hard, but your, your son's gone. We've kind of moved on. I mean, we haven't forgotten him. It's just, uh, you know, time heals all wounds, you know what I mean? Yes, we're done. So, let's get the heck out of here. And we're gonna head on to our adventure. That would be sweet. Anyways, we're... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna wait and we'll go to Madra on the next episode. I will see you later. Bye-bye.